right y'all outfit of the day looking very colorful on this cold day but i'm gonna put a jacket on i'm gonna put a jacket on don't worry about it but i found this in my closet y'all already know the first thing i see i put on and this is the first thing yeah y'all hey slay babes welcome or welcome back to another vlog if you're new here hi my name is fab all right <clears throat> oh excuse me it is thursday 12 30 it felt so good. What is London doing back there? Why she just why she just sit there with her glossy lips? <laughs> Let me put this window down a little bit. Anyways, so it felt so good waking up this morning, not going to work, but I did end up waking up at seven o'clock. That's my body. My body, you know. Waking up every day just got me waking up early. But like I said before. I don't have a problem going right back to sleep. I'll turn on the TV, put something funny on, like always, and I will doze right back off. So I went back to sleep and I woke up about nine, about nine something. Yeah, about nine something. Made a little um, breakfast. I had some egg whites and some avocado toast. Avocado toast. Yeah, that makes sense, right? Yes, it does. I really have to think about it. I'm like, does that make sense? Well, I don't know why I be thinking I was saying it wrong. So I had that, had some tea. I don't have any more creamer. I need my oat milk. I don't, I really need to buy a few things for the house. Like I really need to go grocery shopping. So I'm not too sure what I'm gonna do that. So we had that. We currently at Walmart and they go hubby. He better not start that when we get in here. I said I was gonna ban him. Say hi. Handsome's back. <sighs> let me get let me get you off uh my let me get the tracker off of me. Say hi, babe. Hi, babe. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I need my coffee. Oh, oh gosh. I'm sorry, y'all know I've been using my pocket three all the time now, and it just be moving around by itself all the time. I really need to go back. Sure. <laughs> I really need to go back to using my um, my Sony. But you know what? What happened to me the other day? I was trying to use it and it was looking really dark. So I'm not selling that. And Hubby was telling me too. He was like, "It's all scratched up. Who are you selling that to?" I'm like, "It's really not Man, scratched that up." That been in the blender. <laughs> no. Cosmetics. Cosmetics. Yeah, just on. Just a little scratches here and there. I was not. How much I said I was gonna sell it for? I said I was gonna sell it probably for like four hundred. Four hundred dollars. I need to figure it out because I don't know what's going on with it, and I need to just start using it in the car instead of my pocket three. Even so, you know the pocket three, and it comes out so clear and beautiful. So yeah. <sighs> so we are here again in the car because that's what we do over here. You know, in the comments, if y'all like the new interior of the Lambo. What Lambo? We back at it, y'all. She's snitching 101. You know what Showing a Lambo is, London? Oh, you do? Showing us what? Showing us them snitch skills. <laughs> what you trying to lie to these people for? Oh my God, man! They see the seats of cloth, man. Like this. <laughs> <sighs> only him, only him. So we have a few running around to do, babe. Go. Hubby wants to go to IKEA, so that's what we're gonna do. We, I need to go to Target. What? You need to go to Target? Huh? That was glitching over there. Oh yeah! Like, what is going on? I need to get on Target to get some feminine, feminine. Mm. <laughs> Who's glitching? <laughs> <laughs> some feminine hygiene products. And we're supposed to take London um, out later. Y'all know it's spring break. So this is going to be a spring break vlog. We just got it up in the air. We don't know. I texted Hubby yesterday when I was at work a few suggestions to take London so when we get to that part we'll talk about it because I don't know what we're doing I just so know it was axe throwing mm -hmm. um, what was it selfie museum the selfie museum and I 
the escape room escape again room. but i was looking on groupon you know something a little bit cheaper since you know uh, we are on a budget and we didn't want to spend that much because usually the escape room is about how much did i pay per person it was maybe it probably was a little bit more maybe 50 to 60 dollars per person when we went that one time but it was so much fun it was really fun i we we enjoyed ourselves and we actually escaped that room like, we work well together we really do which you want to say yeah, our family versus your family family games 101 hey we bought this life <laughs> oh my god <laughs> you're in a gang hey never scared hey gang 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 gang. So yeah, um, on Groupon it is, I think it was like 80 for four, but it's only three of us. So we'll figure that part out what we're gonna do, but babe, are you gonna stop at the gas station? I need some coffee. I can't, I can't focus. This is Captain Backseat Driver. <laughs> <laughs> I am, okay? I need to know. I gotta guide you. What? Mm -hmm. Yes, babe, we're going to the gas station. Okay, I have to make sure. He know how I am, like, I don't understand. Then after that, when he get the coffee, I have to make sure where we're going next. <laughs> yes, boss. Anyways, I'll see you all later. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. You know your girl would truly, truly appreciate it. <gasps> my purse was open. Uh oh. Oh my gosh, and your car is so junky, babe. Ooh. your truth <laughs> tell the truth shame the devil the feminine, the fem that doesn't look like feminine products <laughs> the feminine products are all the way down that way why are we this, there. Why are we this way yeah, how it, looks. it looks good i think the feminine products are over there it matches the toilet you're sitting on at ikea <laughs> okay <laughs> y'all hubby right now is changing his clothes what you got going on london you about to go get out no i might get some gum from up here oh, okay um we had another productive day took care of what we needed to take care of went to ikea had lunch and now we're back home like i said hubby is changing his clothes we thought i was gonna take london to the selfie museum and i should have looked into it a little bit better yesterday by reading the reviews so while we were driving back home i said let me look at the reviews so it doesn't sound like something we should do like it's it sound like it's a waste of money but if london wanted to do it we we're gonna go ahead and do it but it do close at nine o'clock and right now it is what time is it where's my phone now we got everything in this car oh man i don't even know where i put my phone y'all I think it's about it's about it's about seven o'clock. It's about seven o'clock, and they close at nine. Oh, it fell. It's seven o'clock. Yeah, it's seven seventeen, and the selfie museum closed at nine. So we're gonna do mini golf. 
We try to do something different with her. We've been skating. We have been bowling several times. What else? Where else have we been we to London? Everything in the book. Everything in the book. And y'all know it's not easy finding something for a teenager to do. And, what, London? And there's not much stuff to do. There's not that much stuff Atlanta. to do? Like, all this stuff is just boring or it's just not for kids under 18. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, y'all yeah. heard it. Y'all heard it. Yeah, hopefully, y'all heard her. So, yeah. So Saturday she has practice and then after practice she is going to hang out with her friends. So, you know, that's good. You know, we're not able to actually, you know, go out of town or do anything else. We didn't plan it properly. It seems like we, we don't plan properly when it comes to spring break. And y'all already know we have something for this month. So we can't do as much. But as long as we spend time together, which we always do, matters to me. And as long as London is happy or wherever we go. We're good to go. Right, London? Yes. We had a productive day. You know, we're happy. Yes. <laughs> we're back there. Yes, yes, yes. So, we're just ready. We're just ready. I just feel like I want to buy everything. Your girl can't afford all that now. You know? When the store like, I want this. I want that. I want this. I want that. I want this. You can't afford it. Just my at one time oh thank you for correcting me that is true there you go yes. not at all at once yes. who else um i need to start looking and see who else is going to ikea i feel like nobody goes to ikea maybe i'm just not really looking at anybody going to ikea i don't know i told you i'll be in my own bubble chat i don't know what people got going on i was just scrolling right now on um instagram like i always do and that's when i see things but let's do a quick haul what i got so this may be a long vlog this time around because i got a lot to do this weekend and actually you know i started earlier today so what we got here i had my little list but hubby in london was distracting me so i know that i need to go to the store by myself that's why i tend to go to the store by myself because hubby just standing there looking at me like, I feel like I'm being rushed a little bit, and I don't like that. Can I can I walk around Target? Who else is like that? When y'all go to Target, don't y'all take y'all time? Y'all not rushing, right? I feel a little rushed. And then London right there, yes. No, nobody was, is distracting her. Yes. You'll find your way to distract your own self. Okay. Calm down back there. Calm down. No, that's the way it's called. Calm down. Yeah, because y'all just standing there looking at me like... you find a way to distract yourself. <sighs> These kids. So, I got some razor. I didn't need much. I'm happy I didn't need much. I got some body oil, mist. This is my first time using this. This is going to be my first time using this. I mean, I want to be very, very moisturized. I don't want to always use my fancy body cream. Baby, that is too pricey. I only use it once in a while. That is too pricey to be using it all the time. Okay, what is it, about $40? Yeah, I ain't doing that. So, this is something I probably use at night with... So, this is my second time buying this. And I don't remember. I don't think it kept me moisturized like that. This light, I don't know. I don't think it really did. So, we're going to try it together. Hopefully. Yeah. Remember, I said I'm not good with... A layering so i don't know if these two are gonna smell good together so i got this again i'm gonna have to hide it from london so she does it I have my you... Own lotion. oh you have your own lotion what lotion you have the same one you do yes that's probably why your um your body splash stays on you yo london so if london could go somewhere people will say hey to her you smell so good london smells good all the time man in the morning when i'm home working from home london will come in the room to say goodbye to me baby that girl smelling good okay because nobody can be smelling stink you get stink no, <laughs> she she i like that about london london gonna she gonna spray that body of hers and then she has it in her book bag too which i'm happy she's learning to do so you already know i got my lumi my favorite deodorant Got some feminine wash. Love this. 
and also I got the honey pot I actually have like the individual wipes as well in my workbook bag always got to be prepared and just these two and these masks this might be like I bought these a few times oh they go hubby right now I try. I try not to get this man on here. I'm about to ban him because you oh, know he'll come oh, in here and say oh. something. He got no business saying like I always oh. say. You ready, my love? That's right. Child looks so weird without these, without my lashes. Y'all see? When you're used to things and then you don't have it anymore, just like I don't have my nails on, which I still didn't schedule an appointment. I'm kind of being lazy when it comes to that. I can finally see her eyeballs, y'all. I, I, I hate it. I hate it. Look at this. I look like I can't see. I can't see. Like I can't see nothing. Where are we going? Oh. <laughs> Friday. It is finally Friday. I shouldn't say it's finally Friday because I took yesterday and today off. Went ahead and did a little monthly maintenance and I was trying to calculate how much I spent already today. And it's only 3.11 right now. Let me take off the tracker. Yeah. So I got my Brazilian. Let me Got my Brazilian, that was $45, added a $10 tip, so that was $55. Got my eyebrow done, that is $10, $2 tip, $12. Got a pedicure, that was $33, and added a $4 tip, so that was $37. So how much is that? It costs to be a woman. It's so expensive to be a woman. So $37, 12 plus 55 that was a, that's is, <laughs> that is $104 already. I didn't get my nails done or my lashes done. So imagine if I got those done, cause usually it is about what? 110 ish, I think. So we're gonna say 120 for the, um, the lashes. Lord, what am I doing? And then if I got my nails done, that's 125. You know, y'all know I get the Gel X, which lasts a about three three weeks to a month, and then I add a tip to that. So what is that? 125 to 145. If I had got everything done, almost 370 dollars. That is, yeah, my monthly. How much is your monthly maintenance? I know there's women out there that. Do everything on their own when it comes to their nails, their eyebrows, their lashes, their feet. You know, are you that type? Because I wish I could do that. I shouldn't say I wish. I I rather not. That's just me. I rather not. I rather just pay and get it done. That's all. But baby, I don't need to go outside anymore. Spending all this damn money yesterday at Target and today, and then I had the nerve to go to Sephora. Yeah, I was so happy that I went alone. I was able to shop in peace without nobody looking at me or asking me, "Is what else do you need? What else do you need? That's kind of like a sign rushing. So I'm kind of happy I was able to do all that. London and hubby are not here. I'm happy I beat them home because London was like, oh, I'm going to be gone all day. No, that's not true because I left the house probably about 10 something because my first appointment which was my brazilian wax was at 11. 
So I did a good time in. I went to Sephora. I said, I'm going to stay there for 40 minutes. I had my list already. So I'm going to get everything I need in here and go. So that's what I did. And then I had and got my pedicure. I didn't want to walk around with, you know, with a new set of polish on because I don't get gel. So I said, like, let me go to Sephora first, then I get a pedicure. And now we are here. You know what I mean? So yesterday we did it. Actually, we went yesterday to take London to mini golf. But when we got there, it was looking kind of empty. These damn people stay calling me. And I have to keep telling them, dance camp, stop calling me. This one guy told me, oh, I wasn't, I'm not the one I've been calling you. I said, yes, this is the same number. Stop calling my phone. And then I, you know, blocked them. Anyways, so yeah, so when we got there yesterday, it was looking real empty and they was going, they were about to close at eight o'clock. We got there about seven ish. So it was like, okay, we'll take her today. This is my spring break, y'all. The usual, the usual. I thought I'd be able just to kind of, kind of relax just a tad bit, but I, I know I'm not going to relax as much because this month is going to be, you know, a very, very busy month. And I'm just like, you know what? Forget it. I'm not tired. I'm not going to say that. I'm not tired. I'm good. I'm good. I'm going to keep pushing like I always do. I ain't tired. So, yeah, so let's do a quick haul before they come here and rush me. Are we going? Are we going? So I picked up just my usual and a few new items. I ain't even going to tell you how much I spent. Y'all see the big bag? It's gonna be a haul, y'all. If you're not into makeup, you can skip this part. Oh, just let it play. You know, you gotta get my watch time up. I see you getting your watch time up is such a hassle on on YouTube. Well, the whole the whole process. Just getting subscribers, watch time, all that is a hassle. To tell you the truth. Nowadays, I just post and keep it moving. It's okay. On God's time. On God's time. It is what it is. I ain't gonna stress it. I'm having a good time. Good time. And we here to have a good time, right? All right, let me stop making all that noise. First thing I got, I always buy the Sephora Melton Cleansing Balm. I use this at night as a pre-cleanse, and then I go ahead and use my cleanser after that. Y'all, when I started double cleansing at night, I noticed a difference. Y'all already know I'm all into skincare makeup. I notice a difference. I use it every night. It breaks down everything, sunscreen, all that, and then I go in with my cleanser. So I got this, and y'all know with the Sephora sell, the Sephora products are 30% off, which is good. Also, I just bought some new brushes. I got a powder brush, because Sephora brushes are pretty good, y'all, and a blush brush as well. I really didn't need no new brushes. I got enough brushes, but I'm trying to switch my um, my powder brush and my blush brush. Hold on, y'all. All right, what else did I get? Let me just take it all out. Let me just go from there. All right, so I got a refill on the Fenty excuse me, the fancy butter drop. That's how I might as well get the refill since I'm almost done with it. Like I said before, I don't use it all the time. I use it once in a while. Mm -mm, not for this price, baby. Mm -mm. Also, I picked up my concealer. I always pick two different shades. I got number nine and number 10. Number nine is more lighter. This one is more close to my shade. Let me show you all really quick. So I'll put the lighter shade in the inner corner because I like a bright under eye, but just not too bright, but I like a bright under eye. So this is how it looks. My favorite, my favorite. I was gonna do this downstairs, but for some reason I just came upstairs with everything. And once I have everything while I'm upstairs, I'm like, forget it, I ain't go downstairs. Only if I need to, only if I need to. So I'm like, forget it. I'll, I'll just record right here and then go chill in the living room for a little bit. So I got the Pharmacy Honey Halo 
um, hydrating moisturizer. I do like this moisturizer. So I got this. You know, I love a, just a glowy skin, very moisturized. It's something I truly love. This is new. This is the one size secure the glow primer. Y'all know I always use the Too Faced um, primer and also the Bobbi Brown first. And then I'll use the, was it? Uh, the Milk Hydro Grip. Those two together, amazing. So the Bobbi Brown or the Too Faced Moisturizer. I always start off with that and then I'll use my Hydro Grip. So I wanna try this. No, I'm a, you know, I'm a, I'm a makeup girl, y'all. I'm a makeup girl. I showed you all this already. I didn't get much. I didn't get much. It looks like I got a lot, but that bill was high. That bill was high. Love me some fancy lip gloss. I love their lip gloss. Oh my gosh. And this color, ooh. I tried it on, but I'm just not gonna put as much on because I don't wanna look like a, I don't want my lips look like a glitter ball. Mm -mm. Like a disco ball. So I'm just gonna add a little bit. Let me show you all. Just in case somebody wants to buy it. So you don't need much. Y'all see it? And I'm not a fan of dark shades because I feel like, oh gosh, I feel like it makes me look older. So I changed that and decided to just wear like lip gloss, light colors, matte colors. Not a fan of anything that's gonna make me look older. Not gonna lie to y'all. I'm just not gonna do it. So hopefully this, I tried it on. It should be fine. I may try it with a, maybe like a plum liner or something. Very light, but just a little bit. Cause I don't want it to be too bright, too bright. Mm -mm. Also, I just got my liner. I like this liner. I was using a one size one, but I noticed once you put the top back on, it started leaking. So like, let me switch to another one. I still don't have a problem with it, but I just don't like that it starts leaking in the cap. So really, really good to use, especially if you're not good at doing a wing liner like me, but it's so good. And then you see how it has this handle right here. Let me close it so it don't dry up. So just so easy to apply. Love this. So I needed more of that. And I was telling the lady, I want something to help with my underarms just to lighten it up a little bit. She was saying, this is really good. And she was like, look, she pulled out her shirt. Like, see, you see my skin, how nice I'm like, okay, mine looks okay too, but I just want it for my underarms. And then she said, I know I go to the same Sephora all the time. She's like, oh, your skin looking good. I was like, but she's mistaking me for someone else because my face looks the same, y'all. Looks the same. I got this little pimple right here that's taking forever. Well, not a pimple now. A dark spot right here that's going to take forever for it to go. So she suggested for me to get this right here. And I got it in a small. I was not going to buy a large one. This is, uh, what is this? First Aid Bump Eraser Body Scrub with a a H A. Cause it says good to use AHA and BHA on your body and your underarms. So I was like, let me try this out and I'll give you all an update about that. So I'm going to give it a good month and then I'll give you all an update. So yes, we'll see. Does it have a smell? I say smell things. Y'all don't be smelling your stuff first and then use it. Do y'all smell your food first and then eat it? It's like almost the same thing. So that's all I got, y'all. That's all I got. So I'm gonna wait for them to come back. Gonna chill on the couch for a little bit. Give me some quiet time. And then I guess we'll just go after that. Oh, Lord. Welcome to my life, y'all. Welcome to my life.
y'all and happy Sunday. Do y'all see anything missing? The bar is gone. Hubby actually sold it, I think. Oh, so I'm being real bootleg right now. Hold on one second. Yeah, so Hubby actually sold it, I think a couple of days ago. He sold some other stuff. So we're getting there when it comes to this house. I was telling Hubby yesterday, it really, I'm not gonna say too much because I'm not trying to put that in the air. I'm really dreading doing my closet and everything else. I know I started and I just stopped and you know, life, just doing other things and I'm like, I'll get to it, but I really need to get to it this month. So I may do that later on, just throw all my clothes in a box and my shoes in a box as well and just let it be, but it's really, it's gonna take a lot out of me when it comes to that. But we're gonna get there. I need to stop BSing when it comes to that. That's you, babe, coming down? Yeah, uh, hey, here you go. So, just wanna give you all a quick update before we go. Sorry, y'all. We know we got a lot of running around to do, and I got a lot of things to do in this month. So, that's probably what y'all gonna see. I may stop recording. I don't know. We'll see how busy I am and how I am with. <laughs> balancing everything um but i'm trying not to do that because i really have no reason to and i'm not putting in the air that i'm going to be tired or anything like that so we're not going to say that we're not so we're not so we're not we're not i am going to take care of myself right we were just talking about taking care of yourself and all that you know not only on the outside and inside as well like yesterday let me stop Y'all look at me. Y'all know I take care of myself. Yeah. Be don't. Why are you touch me like that? Oh my gosh. This man. Did you take some of those vitamins right there? Got that vitamin F this morning. Any. Who? Let me give you guys a quick update. Sorry. Hubby. Yeah, I be saying hubby is funny, but y'all not the one to have to deal with him, okay? When you try to be serious and he just, for some reason, he cannot. Especially when I turn this camera on, he cannot be serious. So, the ax, <laughs> what, babe? I say what? Okay, so what, when do we go to ax throwing? Friday, right? Friday. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we went to ax throwing on Friday. We will, remember I said we was gonna go to do mini golf, but we end up going there. I didn't know it was gonna be that much fun. You can't judge a book by its cover. Cause I was like, yeah, I don't mind. Like we'd like to try new, new things. And that was one of them that we actually, you know, it was our first time there. The guy was very helpful. He gave us some tips. He was always missing a lot. <laughs> Cause I was really concerned about my arm. Like, I'm like, I don't want to, you know, I don't know, I didn't want it to hit me or anything like that. I don't know why I was thinking that, but I was really concerned about it. But you know, I had, I had a little bit. So that was really fun. We only stayed there for an hour and it was about $110 or something like that for it, right? For all three of us? Yeah, for all three. Really cool, you can play games there as well, but we didn't stay to play games when, you know, we went to go, we got dinner, so we didn't worry about that, but it was it was fun. And I think London actually had a good time too, right? Cause then we start competing towards the end. So that made it even, you know, more fun. Child got Sprite wasted. Yeah, she, yeah, she got, we gave London some Sprite. I think I told you all, I don't really buy soda like that. So, only time I buy soda is like ginger ale when I'm, you know, my little drink and drink, but we don't really buy soda. So, London had Sprite that day, that night, and I don't know, she went from zero to 100, like just that quick. I was like, London, are you okay? Did you have some of my drink? <laughs> That's what you asked her. Did you have some of my drink? Because you're really high right now. Like, she was like all in our face and just excited. <laughs> like, you okay, London? It was like, damn, that's right. I was like, see, that's how it is when you don't give your kids no, all that sugar. It, it, it was that sugar hit, yes. Yeah, so it, it, it was funny. So yesterday, um, you know, she, you know, she went to practice. 
We had some more running around to do. And she actually went to her friend's house and watched a movie. Hubby and I went out yesterday. Actually, he dragged me yesterday out. He wanted to try this cigar bar, but didn't end up smoking no damn cigar. So I'm kind of confused why we went. I'm confused why we went. I already knew he wanted to go. He always, like, you know how you know your partner? Yeah. Yeah, I know mine. Once he start playing that music <laughs> and ask me again, babe, are we going? I'm about to get ready, babe. I'm about to get ready. That's how I know he really wants to go. So I'm like, okay, that's fine. I ain't give her the space opportunity. <laughs> you really no. did. You really did give me. It was five more minutes and she was on that couch. She gonna be, you still want to go there? <laughs> yo, yo. I'm comfortable. <laughs> Yep. Yeah, get, like, listen. Yeah, you don't need no makeup or nothing. Just go. No. I'm, I'm waiting on you. Bet. That's all I need to hear. I'm out. So that's why I just threw whatever on and just went. It was a really chill spot. It's for actually people our age, 40 and over, you know? You know? We can still have a good time. Good time, depending if you want to have a good time. I'm just saying. I'm going to do what it do. Have a good time and everything else. Vibe. Yeah, it, it, was it was a good vibe. We <laughs> saw uh, Bobby Valentino out there. Minus, he wasn't there with Saucy Santana, though. That's why I said that. That's why you said that? Oh, my God, no. Don't be like that. Excuse me. Ooh! So, yeah. Um, I'll be acting like he's a little young thing out here. Like, we over 40, honey. We need to slow it down just a tad bit. We don't need to be doing all this. But we haven't <laughs> been out in a while. Y'all know. <laughs> What? <laughs> we have we haven't been like out. We usually like hit up a bar or something, and I know him. Like I said, then he gonna turn around and say, oh, "We're not going anywhere else." I didn't ask you to come here. I did not ask you to come here. Yeah. <laughs> but no, I, I'm kind of like done going out. Even so, I mean done. Yes, going outside because it costs so much. Now we about to hit up the store and then pick up London. When is going to end? When is going to end? They didn't tell us when we was younger that being an adult is... <laughs> Forever. Forever. I didn't think I... Mm, I didn't feel it until like... Because I always lived... I had my own apartment when I was in my 20s. So, But it was cheap. You know, it was cheap. I had to pay my car no I had insurance my car insurance electricity and all that but it was you know it was okay for the amount I was getting paid for but now what babe but now I know I would say what babe because you know he always got something to say what what is this then came Superman she didn't pay no more bills I do pay bills. <laughs> 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 20s. What about the 30s and 40s? Uh, uh, we love you. <laughs> don't. Please don't pay him no mind. Y'all know he's joking. But anyways, let us go, babe. You ready? I <laughs> did that like three times. Anyways, hope you all enjoyed this vlog. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. You know your girl would truly, truly appreciate it. And turn your notification on so you don't miss out on your girl. Because we are growing and glowing yeah, over here. Subscribe and talk about it. <laughs> the slay babes, that is. I, it's down, babe. Subscribe. Like. Yeah. Thank you, babe. And tune in. There you go. So I might start a new one. The yeah, same old guys. This is life. Same old things. Yes. <laughs> Unfortunately. 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 Yeah. <laughs> like I always say, until next time.